everybody, welcome. Happy Halloween to you all. I hope you're having a great day, night, whatever time it is for you, wherever. Uh, I hope you're having fun, staying safe, you know, relatively so. Um, we have a lot of spooky games to cover tonight. I'm your host, Robert Gelfand. I go by Gel513. Sorry, I'm just uh, trying to think. Let's see if I can turn down settings here now to load into the game. Um, but yeah, I wanted to start it off with something a little less spooky, because I wanted to do something silly like this uh, earlier in the month and just kind of fell by the wayside. Uh, when it ran out of days. Um, but yeah, we're here with uh, Stardew Valley. It's a harvest game. It's got elements of Minecraft to it. Uh, it it's very similar to the um, Harvest Moon games. Uh, they go, those go by a new name now. I forget what it's uh, called. But... Lots of Minecraft to it. Sorry, uh, it's... Uh, So, the tricky thing about this game, especially early on, is because it has RPG elements, uh, like, everything takes energy, so you have to, like, spend a lot of time leveling up to get better at doing things, uh, get more efficient at farming, harvesting, uh, resources, and the like. Oops. I have some mayo here. Uh, a lot of things in the works still. Tomorrow's going to be a beautiful sunny day. Um, okay. So, everything here I need to water. I gotta start things off. I don't have uh, enough sprinklers to get everything. Uh, early on, you know, I'm only in the second year of the game. The game goes by seasons. Each season is um, 30 days, so it's kind of truncated. Just one month is a season, so four months is a year. Um, and you start out in summer. Just like all this is overgrown, you have to clear it all out. Uh, you gotta build up a relationship with the townspeople, you gotta do things to like improve the town uh, if you want, which helps you ultimately. Uh, you know, there's fishing to do, there's all kinds of things. It's also got elements of animal pro like if you played any kind of like harvest or like town simulator game, there are elements of it here. Um, it's pretty fun, I really enjoy it. Very addicting, uh, very easy to lose a lot of time playing. And like back at the start, doing that much watering would have like completely drained my character of energy. Uh, but now, no worries. So. Looks like I was going to plant some stuff. Um, So 
and I've grown a ton of strawberries uh, in the spring, which is really helpful. Uh, looks like I'm just going to be planting stuff. Uh, that's what my plans seem to be. I can't remember. Like, I played this months ago and haven't touched it since. I already did that. Uh, that needs milk. Do we have any milk? I tried to color code them based on. Oh shit, I didn't let them out yet. I forgot I had animals to let out. They're not gonna be happy. Fill it up. I should really just leave the doors open during the day. chicken. Uh. And hi, I have chickens, I have ducks, Donald Dank, Andra. I named everything after weed. I felt like the funniest I realized in this is that marijuana strain uh. names are actually really good names for cows. So, Lemon Haze, yep, Girl Scout, Berry White, Skeef for the Goat, Blue Dream. I feel like those are all good names for cows. Uh, is that not on some automatic? It's got the uh, shit. I shouldn't actually need to do it. Where can I see? Huh? Can you tell how much green? Oh shit! I have none. Uh, even if I built um, 
sprinklers for it right this second. They wouldn't go until the morning. So I want to make sure these guys get watered right away. That's right, the kill makes charcoal. Gotta go with those. Um, Oh, I can build one. Sweet. Wood and gold. So as you can see, it's a lot of this. I'm not even going into town or fishing today. I'm just kind of catching up with basic fucking chores like resource management and whatnot. Uh, but there's all kinds of shit you can do. There's a whole map um, of places to go. There's a whole desert area I haven't even explored yet. There's the mines over this way uh, where you can get more like ore type resources. Um, there's a lot of shit to do. too often. It's already 5.40 p.m. Time moves very fast in this game. I will automatically pass out at 2 a.m., so I want to be back in bed, otherwise, like, there's a penalty incurred, kind of, for, like, some, some like, fine June carries back home, but costs you. It's a pain in the ass. Okay, so... Enough for that. And now, okay, okay.
It's a very relaxing game. Except for when you're running out of time. Like, when you have time to do the things you need to do or have the energy and whatnot, it's fun. Just realizing that stuff wasn't getting watered. Sell all that. Um, hold on, throw it away. Whoops. One sec, got a text, just gotta check it out. Sweet. Um, just some family stuff real quick. Now, get that side of the way. Drop this stuff off to be sold. Uh, that will keep. Oh, crap. Midnight, I get it. Just want to get out there and get a little bit more grass, more hay for my animals. And that's a day in the life uh, in Stardew Valley. I'm gonna do one more day of this and then we'll move on to something else. I just wanted to 
do a little quick peek. Since today, we'll just do a little bit of watering. We have everything planted. Um, I just want to check on my animals, make sure they're doing okay. And then uh, we'll go into town and shit. be a way to check whether I have enough hay. I don't know how to do that though. Hmm. Weird. Oh, whatever. Let's go ahead in the town and see what's up. Oh shit, those don't cover that so fuck. Whoops. Whoopsies. Yeah, not this. Okay. Oh, whatever.
Let's just not have one going for a while and not really use it. That's a bus where I could go to the desert. Um, I want to start earlier in the day, though, if I was going to do that. Make the most out of it. Here's the mayor. wishes to study the arcane properties of the pike, he will be awarded 300 gold on delivery. He makes wizards happy. Except quest, let's do some fishing, you guys. Actually, let's see if we can be leaving it down. Um, this guy just growing right now. So I'll need some more melon seeds, I guess. Skater boy has to say. He's trying to do a kickflip. He won't, he won't talk to me. try. I didn't even really have to do it that much. The running in this game can be a little weird when you're using an analog stick because it's still eight directional. Um, in fact, do I have auto run turned off? Here 
Here we go. What a way. Yeah, gee, I wonder why. You practice witchcraft. Only I will deal with you. Piece of sashimi. Okay. Uh, piece of sashimi. Right, skull key goes to the desert mine thing. Their shorts are right there. What is my friendship level with Marnie? Very poor. Damn. That'll be a longer term goal. Let's head back to the farm. Right at 420. Blaze up. First. For a scarecrow. Uh, wood, coal, and fiber. Okay.
I just waste it. Oh shit, I wasted the rare seed. Whoops. I thought I was planting the fucking apple. Fuck. Hmm. Whoops. Wasted it. Oh well. Um, whatever. That's a lot of stuff done. seeds out here. Um,
And now it's time for bed. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. One more day. And then we'll move on to something else. That's what always seems to happen with this game. Eh, should we call it here? Yeah, maybe we should. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to move on from Stardew Valley. Just wanted to give you guys a taste. Don't want to spend too much time on it. There's a lot of things to do, like Halloween multiplayer events. I think we're going to do some Rainbow Six Siege next. Ooh, rainy day. All right, so I'm going to quit out of this. Thank you guys so much for tuning in or watching uh, later on in Archive. I'm Robert Gelfan. I go by Gale513, and Spooktacular Scarathon continues. Happy Halloween, everybody.